Hey guys, Edog Plays here, bringing you guys another video. Today we're hopping back on Idle, Idle Factory. Sorry, I was about to say Idle Tycoon, Idle Factory. So honestly, I've been wanting to play this game so much today. Um, today is the same day as when you guys saw the last episode because I am pre-recording a bunch of videos for Texas. So I honestly I can't wait to get into this. So your workers have been busy. Time offline one hour and thirty seconds. Which I think it has, I think it has been a little bit longer than that. I'm pretty sure it's been longer than that. But idle cash earned was seven hundred thousand dollars. Nice. I'm not gonna double it in 1.4. We, I mean, we earn money fast enough as is. So we have unlocked the drill. It sells for twenty-two dollars. We'll buy for eighty thousand. So it sells for twenty-two dollars and only requires one steel. So how are we gonna get steel? That's well, that's what it's telling us right here. Um, blueprints. Production upgrades. Upgrade your resources to make more money. $96,000 to upgrade to a drill. Okay, so what does it do? It? Oh, so the steel is going from our last worker to the new worker and generating us money from that. So, now what we're going to have to do. Okay, so it says, oh, boost. I don't want to watch an ad to boost, but um, so we got 406, 800 metal sitting down in there. Um, how is this going to work now? So now they pick up the metal. So I think what we're going to need to do is we're going to have to upgrade this guy. Let's upgrade this. Well, this isn't very expensive to upgrade. So let's upgrade him 10 times. Now, hopefully, he's going to be making a lot more steel to put to this guy. Because, obviously, this guy's going to be earning us a lot more money now. Like, a ton more money now. So, the, all our money is coming from this last guy now. Because all the m the materials that are the that's being made by the first guy are going to the second guy to make the drill. Which is really, really cool. I just hope that these, uh, these guys are going to be able to handle it. I mean, we don't need to upgrade... A warehouse anymore really at all free super cash come back every four hours to come your free super cash I mean we'll hit allow sure we receive 20 super cash um, get cash based on your current production so we can spend uh, super cash to earn more I don't cash call double your offline income I mean there, I'm sure there's boosts that we could buy but I don't really want to buy them yet um, hmm we need to upgrade our market though for sure a hundred thousand dollars which isn't that expensive um we are let's buy the new workstation honestly it looks like everything's keeping up um i really don't know how i mean let's do another 10 upgrade there just so we can make sure that that guy's making enough metal for that guy because honestly if he stops making enough metal then we're all in trouble I'm happy. I'm really happy with the progress we made. So let's upgrade that. Well, I would want to try to get it to level 25 so it can earn us that huge boost. But uh, yeah, like I said, I'm worried that it's just going to run out of metal. That's my main concern right now. But it is making 1.19 million per second. So a huge, huge, huge amount of money. The next big production increases at level 50, so $145,000, and then we'll have enough, which is going to be like right now. Perfect. There we go. So now it's earning $142,000 per minute, and this needs only $41,000. So that just tells me right there that it can handle this, which is perfect. Let's buy this new workstation, though. It's going to be producing steel as well. Okay, so what do we want it to produce, though? Um, maybe we should save up for a toaster, but for right now, let's do cans. Oh, we can act. Oh my goodness. There is so much to this game that I did not even realize. So I want to upgrade this. It's going to take five minutes to upgrade and we're going to upgrade the cans. So right now we're going to be selling the cans from this guy. Hopefully he's going to be getting enough rock, which he is not. So let's do a 10 upgrade, which should easily be able to do it. Um, perfect, perfect, perfect. But, uh, this game, man, it, there's just, there's so much. Okay, steel bars. So what if we want to upgrade the steel bars? Can research in four minutes. So we want to do as much research as we can. And I, what happens when we upgrade the steel bars and the steel bars are going currently to making the drills? What happens then? Okay, well, this guy needs 48,000 per minute. 
and it is not getting 48,000 per minute. Anywhere near 48,000 per minute. Hmm. That's, that's really cool. That's interesting. Very interesting. There's... There's so much to this game. I thought it was simple. I thought it was okay. Let's just try to get to the bottom. It is nothing like that. There's so many little upgrades you can do. This game is probably better than Item Hunter. I'm sorry, guys. If you see a bunch of these videos coming out soon, I, I, I can't help myself. I want to keep playing this. I want to play this game offline, but I, I don't think I can. So uh, we can buy the toaster. So we're definitely going to go and buy the toaster now. It requires one can and one steel. Okay. Input missing. Produce cans at workstation above and re-import it. Oh. So we need to produce cans up above, which is going to be make us more money. Uh, we're going to make a lot more money making the toaster rather than the drill. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to make cans up here. So now the cans are going to go into here. Input missing. So we need to... Okay. So the metal is going to be going... Hmm. What does the cans need? Requires just one brick or one uh, rock. There we go. Okay. So now that's going to start making that. We need to make it... So you could shift it over. Do you want to sell it for money or do you want to keep on passing it down the line? So we want to pass that down. And the transporters are going to bring it to the next table. Okay, that, that makes complete sense. It does. Um, okay. We don't need to do any upgrades for that right now. But we have $200,000 just sitting in there. So we probably should upgrade our market. $700,000 is quite expensive. But uh, I also want to make sure we keep on upgrading our... Um, these guys are warehouse because obviously if our warehouse starts to slow down. We're going to start slowing down. The money is going to stop coming in. $600,000 is sitting down there. Holy crap. We're making so much money from this now. I want to start. Well, okay. The upgrading, we're upgrading the cans right now, right? Cans skip for 20 super cash. There's only one minute left, so we can wait one minute, but I'm, I'm curious to see what happens when we upgrade the cans. Well, the cans are going to be needed to make the toaster. So now is the toaster just going to be earning us more money? Uh, is it even going to be able to make the toaster? How is that going to work? We're going to buy the new workstation right off the bat. Ooh, we got a map. Oh my goodness. Workstation. So at the top, General Factory, we got buy workstation 12 in General Factory. Oh my goodness, there is so much to this game. This game is absolutely amazing. I, like, this game is awesome. So we are running out of steel. Why is it running out of steel? Okay, well... Why is it... Oh, because the steel shifted over there. I don't want the steel to be shifted over there. It's not what I asked. It's not what I wanted. So now the steel is going to be dropped off there. And the cans. Steel and cans. There we go. And then we need the rocks dropped off here to make the actual metal. Um, but I don't think I want to make metal here. Mm, we need something that requires rock though. That's the thing. Hmm. We need something that uses rock because from the... Dr or from... Well, if we... Then the toasters are just being moved down there. We don't really need toasters down here. I don't think we're gonna need toasters. Because, I mean, we're at the very bottom. Maybe to make copper stuff you need toasters. I'm not too sure. I think we'll make the cans. Uh, I mean, for right now, let's just make whatever makes us the most amount of money. Let's just turn it on cans. And then we're gonna be making the most amount of money. Only 23,000 is coming down from there. We definitely need to do a 10 upgrade as soon as possible. So right now it's transporting 358,000 per minute. Now transferring 1.97 million. Perfect. That is what I needed. <sighs> okay. Hopefully the bottom now is going to get enough rocks. 70 or 50,000. That should be enough. It is now making copper. Okay. So I don't think it really matters for these guys. The, 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 uh, the guys that are moving the copper cans down. But it definitely affects these guys. They're making a lot more money. Sell for 30% more. Which is ridiculous. Um, 
So, what about this steel? Let's buy that. Research in five minutes. Skip. I just want to skip it. Let's just get rid of it. So now, all the steel is going to be earning us more money. Maybe making more steel? I'm not 100% sure. If you guys do know, upgrading this, like, I need to know. Upgrading the steel, is that benefiting us for the ones where we're passing it down to different places? I, I, that probably didn't really make a whole lot of sense. But, okay. Okay. Uh, we can't even do that if we wanted to. Let's, I mean, we might as well keep making toasters. Because now the cans are just going to keep getting shifted. The toasters are being sold. But we have the metal and the cans being produced. There's a lot of metal and cans at the top one here. So, I mean, we might as well upgrade that. That's only 3 mil to upgrade. Now earning us 14.8 million per second. That's a lot of money. We have 9,000 steel, but we have no cans. So our can production definitely is going to need to be upgraded. And let's upgrade our steel production if we can. Well, okay. We need to get it at an even number so it looks better. We need to make sure we're getting enough steel and cans so we can keep progressing further and further. So the toasters are being sold. The toasters are being sold. But we're not getting any cans. So... Okay, there it dropped off 52,000 cans. We have 48,000 sitting in there waiting for these transporters to get their stuff together. Um, okay. Well, let's see. I want to make sure they're actually transporting the cans down further and not just dropping them all off at this top one. Because the bottom and the steel, we're missing a lot of steel. Only 260 steel. So that's a bit annoying. We need to make sure we have enough steel going down. All of it's being dropped off here, and it's a little frustrating. I mean, we're only making 14 million from there and 30 million from there. So honestly, it would just make sense if we turn this into making steel. Let's turn that into making steel. And I mean, as soon like. I don't think we need two things that are selling. I think we need more people producing than we do selling. So now there's going to be a bunch of resources here. Let's make sure we keep on leveling it up as much as we can. Because now this is where we're earning all of our money. So everything else is going to be producing. This is where we're earning our money. So if we were chose to sell, we wouldn't really make a whole lot. Um, yeah, we wouldn't make a whole lot if we chose to sell. We'd make 400,000 per minute. Here we'd make 1.8 million. Here, I mean, we're making a little bit. Oh, right now we're selling the steel? No, 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 no. Well, now we're making 23,000. We have 23,000 steel there, but now we ran out. So now it's like, okay, well, we need to start setting it down. Hmm. I think we're going to buy this next workstation. Purchase workstation. I don't want to rate it yet. But, uh, so here, we're making toasters. We don't want to make toasters. So we're making, uh, let's make these... Yes, yeah, so we have one guy producing, two guys producing steel. I want this guy to start producing more cans. And I want it to s move it down to here. Activate the toaster. Now, this is where we should start to see a lot of money coming from. Okay? So now, all the steel and all everything else, all the steel and all the cans are going to be produced all the way down here. Pushed all the way down to the bottom here. Where we're going to be earning $233 million per minute. So hopefully we're going to have a ton of resources just laying here waiting to be produced, to be used. But it does require 3.11 million per minute of each cans. So we're not making enough cans right now. So we need to upgrade that. Hopefully we can get that to level 10 so we get a huge bonus. Um, oh my goodness, what is this? Okay, so these are your upgrades, the production upgrades. We always want to be upgrading something. So let's upgrade the toaster. That's going to take five minutes. Uh, you know what, let's speed it up for super cash. Let's start up unlocking now in the 80% upgrade. We definitely still need more steel. Again, now we're running out of steel. So now let's upgrade. Get it hopefully enough to get more steel. I mean, let's just do basically the m most amount of upgrades we can. We have enough cans, but we don't really have enough steel. That's what's kind of hurting us here. But now we have quite a bit of everything. I mean, actually we don't. We really, really don't. We need a lot more steel. A lot more steel. 
So, I mean, that's producing 74,000 per minute, and this is only producing 400. And we need 3.1 million. So, we are falling quite behind on that, but we're still making quite a bit of money. 65 million. Okay, I'm being dumb. And I'm not upgrading these levels, and that's what's really holding us back, because there's $75 million sitting in the bottom that I didn't even realize. And that is really, really holding us back, because now we're going to have a bunch of money. Look it, now we're going to have a bunch more money to upgrade all of our steel production. We need $70 million. That's going to be easy to get once these guys get their crap together. $25 million upgrade. That's expensive, but that's what we need. We need these type of things. And also, these guys are really, really slow. They can only transport 1.97 per minute. And we need 3.11 per minute. So, everything is getting quite diff not quite difficult. It it's We're kind of upgrading the wrong things right now. Um, but we definitely need to upgrade our steel production. That is absolutely no excuse for that. But I think our transporters is what's kind of holding us back right now. Because that's producing... 2.99 and this is producing 400,000 so we definitely have enough steel now but now we need our transporters to be able to carry all of that and it's leaving we have 1.4 million steel just sitting in there so we're definitely going to need to do a lot of upgrades for our warehouse and I mean a lot of upgrades like a ton of of upgrades guys i didn't even realize the time i'm so sorry this is gonna be a super long video i'm honestly having so much fun i'm gonna have to make so many more videos on this game because it is absolutely amazing if you have enjoyed please go ahead and smash the like button and subscribe so you guys don't miss any more daily content and subscribe if you guys are new around here i said that twice i will see you guys in the next video peace out